Hello, the game has started. It's me to go first. Just say hello to opponent. Right now, what have I got? I've got some clunky consonants, which are good scorers. But I'll be looking to get rid of a few of those. And hopefully get the rack into bingo territory. Now, do I have a five-letter play? I do. I have phobia. Do I have... I have phobia. I have fakey. No. Fovia with K I. Yeah, I'll go with this. Not a good pickup. Duplicate I's and the L's. Um, kill. Okay, opponent has exchanged three. Um, <sighs> Foveal and Kilo, maybe. Terrible pickup. Draw the V and the duplicates just continue, even though I did sort them out from the previous rack. Um, live or ver. Viral is good, but doesn't play anywhere apart from this V here but that's hardly worth doing arrival that seems okay that'll sort the oh I don't have two A's I have two R's Maybe just liver. No. I think I'm going to change here. I'm not seeing a play. Maybe Lurie. 14 has to be better than changing. Thriver that plays next to key. Hopefully that will remain available. Fatal, does that take anything? F femme fatale. Maybe an E. Opponent does bingo there. Unfortunately, oh, I was thinking Thriver might play there, but doesn't see. Oh, it does play here. Thriver. That works. For 84. 
Not a good pickup. The W, U, and C go terribly together. These three guys, they certainly don't like hanging around with each other. Um, well, not on my rack anyway. Now, Wenge is good, but not seeing a great spot for that. Ngui is good, so twenty seven, not bad. Uh, what about something through this O? Co Cog is good, C O G U E, but that doesn't help me. Crew is good, C R E W E. Um, G-U-N, not terrible together. The U-N has some synergy. I'm going with this, 30 points. And it takes out a hot spot. I was just going to say I could have played Rung. W-R-U-N-G. I spotted it as I hit Enter. And I've got pretty much the same rack as previous, except instead of the W, I have the M. Okay, opponent bingo, so I'm uh, still slightly ahead, but pretty much level. Now, Coman. Congru, no. Um, hmm. I have nothing for going next to the S, so I should forget about that for now. I have menu, no. Wow, this is a not an easy maybe just E M Wow, this is not easy. just mean 27 decent score just couldn't see anything much better I've got Job for a, a decent score there I'd takes an E ah Job spot goes Jag is good and J E nothing J U Jube, that works. 37, I think I'm... Oh, unless... Jube... Just looking at a five-letter play. Maybe even a B-E play. B... 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 Jog? No. B... B... Mm, no. I'm going with Jube. Not a great pickup. I do have Wak on my rack for 30. Zingy's a nice score for opponent. Ah, oh, okay, it was 22, so it wasn't. Uh, it wasn't a double. I thought it might be a double word. 
Awati. No, Awato is good. So, Awato there for 30, creating a hotspot. Now, is there something ending in Y? And what about... Ah... Maybe just Avo, but it doesn't. It's 27. It takes out a hot spot. But the rack leave is pretty poor. Don't like that. I like the idea of taking it away from opponent because it represents a big score. But the rack leave and the score, not ideal. Um... Now, this takes an OW, 26, not terrible, but I'm liking WAC, I know it takes an S, 30 points, I'm going with this for tile turnover. Okay, um, etymology. LOG is what I was thinking of. Okay, Poddy scores quite well. Um, etymology through an A and an M. Wow, that would be awesome. Does the B assist? Not to my knowledge. My time is running down, so do I have... I have love. I have glove. What about lovey? Lovey is EY, not... I have glove. I'm going with glove. 37. It's a good score. I draw the Q. I didn't really want it. Um, if I draw an A, I'll be in a lot better shape with that Q. But this S hook for WAC is going to prove to be very uh, dangerous if I don't take it out. Yeah, he plays there. Now, um, Kiter, Rent, and... I think I might play try here because it preserves my one and only vow and what about Tyro? Does Tyro play anywhere? Mm. Try is 23. It doesn't give back much to opponent. And Tyro plays off an extra letter, so I might go with Tyro. And then in the hope of drawing... Nah, I think I'm going to go with... Ah, oh, Troy. That works. 21. Oh, terrible pickup. <sighs> that was bad. Yeah, if I don't draw an A, I'm in real trouble here. Spet. Okay, I'm in trouble. I'm in serious trouble. The Q, I'm going to be swallowing the Q. And that could be cost me the game. If my opponent just slowly ekes it out, he will win this game when he realizes I've got no no way. 
can't play Chin anywhere. I really was hoping to draw either an I, a U. I mean, three U's, you would have expected one of them to land up on my rack over the last three oh. racks. I'm just going to try eke out some points here. So, MM is 12. I don't want to play my tiles off too quickly. Dancer will give me some score as well. Mad is also 12. I think I'm going to go with MM just to eke out the points. Uh, I think opponent's going to win this. Yeah. I just cannot score enough to to bridge the gap. <gasps> Glover and Grow, that's a nice little scorer. That might give me a slight chance, but where can I play my N? Five, six points there. Dancer is quite nice as well, but Grow and Glover definitely definitely scores more. Glovin, I don't think Gnau is good, but I don't think Glovin, Glovin, no, it's Cloven. So, I think I have to play the R there. And, wow, what a close game. Opponent setting himself up. I'm going to go with Grow and Glover for 18. Wow, this is crazy. Where can I score with my N? Okay, five, six points there. Nad is no good. That has to be Go Nad. Um, okay, opponent's played his U. I think. I'm going to go with Orn. Yeah. I've got 35 seconds. Donson, Gun. Nish and Kilon. No. Okay, I've got to go with Orn, I think. And now I just have to keep passing, but hopefully I've got enough to... Our opponent has the has the control of the board. So he can really search for every possible score to to eke out the 30 points or 23, 24 points he needs to win. Yeah, he's won it. I think he might have won it. He's got to play a U somewhere. Oh, maybe not. I've got to pass. If he passes, I've got to pass. Wow. That, that Grow and Glover play, that saved me, I think. That was an 18-point play. I don't... I think it would have been a lot closer if opponent... Wow, he's going to get 20 points, so he'll be on 399. He only needs 3 points to win, or 3 to draw, 4 to win. But does he have a four-point play? I'm not seeing it. Wow. Look at that. One point. 
Gee. What a finish. That was nail-biting. Let's see if there was a win at all. Gee, what a finish. Okay, first play was Fovia, and it looks fine. Analyzer likes it. So happy with that one. Uh, shocker of an opening rack, but out value. Look at that for 65, a bingo. Sometimes those shockers actually yield bingos. Um, and that's why it's good to learn your five vowel, eight letter words, because there are a lot of them and they do crop up pretty frequently. So opponent goes with an exchange. Now Kilo for 22 seems fine. Ilk, slightly better rack leave and a better score. Well, is it a better rack leave? It's similar. Um, not much in those, I think kilo now flatmate for 72 and faldetta faldetta tricky and also those uh, compound words not so easy to spot um, tailgate as well and saltate dilatate through the eye so there were a few there but um, not so easy um, to to spot with the blank on the rack. Virile, that would have been the play, I think. V-I-R-I-L-E. And it doesn't give any access to the trip because of the V. So virile, I'd say, was a miss. Um, yeah, because I-R-V, not nearly as good as I-R. Uh, toy boxes for 117. Look at that. Four timer. 117. Toy boxes. Beautiful. Really hot, hard to spot. But opponent does score 80, uh, 86. And Thriver then did play, which was good. I thought it it had been blocked by opponent, but he created another spot for it. Now, that looks like a good rack, but no bingo on offer. And in seems fine with a strong rack leave. Rung, I did spot as I hit the enter button. I realized I could have got rid of the WU combo, which um, immediately improves the rack by a huge margin in terms of equity getting rid of that U and W isn't like a big priority so that one went down and then oh that's quite a nice rack Intarsia Vitrains Rainiest Inertias and Satinia that's the one that opponent went with Satinia and then emu for 31. Where was that? L4. Ah, very nice. I did actually think of that word, but I was wondering if it played here. And then I noticed UE was no good. So I didn't look at it as playing down there. That would have been fantastic. 31 points, gone astray. Um, I scored 27, which wasn't too far off the pace, I guess. Now, big A, big a for 32, and uh, that looks fine for opponent. Um, but the ADP rack leave a lot better. That's why the equity was higher. And then I've got Jube for 37, but C9... Jube, oh, okay, yes, but I did notice that it stopped one square short, and I thought, um, yeah, maybe it was worth doing, but then a play of Zoes or Cheese, QIS, and Jubes, well, I suppose that then gives score back to me there, so maybe it wasn't as volatile as it could have been. Um... Yeah, it's a nine-point sacrifice, so 
I don't know. Anyway, um, not far off either way. Now, opponent only had consonants here, but he had a 34-point play. Gazy through the A of Fatal. Um, he goes with Zingy for 22. And now Cogway onto the Y. That was quite nice. Cogway, never seen it before. Uh, Gorsi was also good. That I have seen and played. So I should have spotted Gorsi really. Um, Wark was what I went with for 30. Potty for 36 was a good way to sort the rack out and score. And then I'm... I've got this rack and glove was best for 37. Um, Fado's for 40 was a big score. Now I've got this rack and I'm thinking what to do with this Q. And I'm thinking I'll pick up an A at some point or an I. Um... But there were, or a U, that's what I was thinking. If I pick up a U, at least I've got Qua over here or over there. Um, I just needed something, you know. Even Queen, Q, U, W, E, N. Anyway, it didn't uh, eventuate. So Troy was okay for 21. And what was my thinking here? Troy. Ah, uh, tile turnover. I was thinking if I turn over a lot of tiles, I'll pick up either a U, A, or I for my Q. But uh, that plan never, never um, bore fruit. And those are exactly the tiles I needed for my Q. And opponent sitting with a rack full of them. He was probably um, wishing to pick the queue up at this stage. Because it, it goes so well with these tiles. Now he doesn't have a great option here for scoring. Um, but I suppose June for 25 at N7. D-U-N-E doesn't give back much to me and 25 puts him on 330 so we then level um, I wonder and even though he's got a vowel heavy leave there are fewer vowels than consonants so it actually suits him to hang on to some vowels especially the U in the event he draws the Q so I quite like the play of nude for those reasons stated. Yeah, just down there. Um, he goes with Don's for 31, which was also a great score. And then I spotted Spet for 34, and I thought, how can I not take the points at this juncture? Because we're neck and neck. And I thought, there's one tile in the bag. Can it be a U or an I? Um, and I thought, if I have to swallow the Q, at least score big points in as a trade-off for, sw for swallowing it. And it actually did work out for me, because opponent now had... Wow, look at his rack. He's got scoring potential. He's got... 28 for OH. Now that might have been crucial. OH there gives nothing back to me. Um, but what it does do is it gives him 3 points more than OH at 14N. Okay, so if he had, and he had loads of time, so he could have looked around the board a little bit more and realized he's got an extra three and he only lost the game by one point so i think he could have possibly won this one um 
So he goes there, then I do my... Oh, the, and that actually gave me the Grow Glover play. So OH was definitely a losing play um, insofar as it didn't score as much as OH here on the left, but also gave me an 18-point play when I didn't really have... Um, have such a high scoring play elsewhere. So I get 12 for double M and then opponent plays Uoi through the O at E6. I oh, know he doesn't. He plays Gu for 3. Um, uh, he was obviously trying to eke out points. So 9 for Uoi or 3 for Gu. But then yeah, I wonder if he goes out quickly with Uoi. But he still can't go out with W, can he? I don't see a W outplay. No, so I think at this point it probably is lost. Unless he he can't even block the Grow Glover play. I don't think. Oh, no, he could have. No, he couldn't have. Okay, so then Goo comes down. Glover and Grow. UI for 9 here. Now, this is interesting because he scored... Four. Um, if he goes with Uoi for nine, I play. I play my N for six, and then he would have had. Um, I think he would have won. I think Uoi gave him the few extra points he needed to win. Because he could have then eked out. Ah, uh, no, but he goes Uoi. Oh, it's just too hard to kind of put it in. He Uoi gave him, I think he might have won it. Because he only lost by one point. And I'd need to really sit down and do the analysis. But a nail biter anyway. Um, oh, let's see if he had a slightly higher vein for eleven. Oh, but he—that's right. He—he he actually scored more with vein than yeah. You are interesting. I—I uh, I don't think it was winnable. Maybe from that point. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed watching that game, and I will see you next time.